Hello, my name is Dominique Mochianu. You've got the true story of an Olympic gold medalist. Well, I started gymnastics at age three because my parents enrolled me in the class. They even tested my strength when I was six months old on a clothesline, and I held on till the clothesline broke. So for them, that was a sign that I was destined to be a gymnast. There were times where my coaches, um, leading up to the Olympics, they, they didn't uh, have open communication when it came to injuries. They didn't want their athletes to speak out in the open. They always felt that that was a sign of weakness. Right before the 1996 Olympic Games, I suffered a stress fracture in my tibia. I was 14 years old and it was five weeks away. That was one of the most scary moments uh, in my young career because I didn't know if I was going to make the Olympic team. I actually had to be petitioned to the Olympic trials and this was an overuse injury, but being afraid to open up to my coaches and to my father that there was something going on. Once I finally collapsed in the gym, then somebody started paying attention. I'd had the success, but I didn't feel fulfilled and I didn't feel that I had purpose. Winning the gold medal, I, I certainly view it much differently now than I did as a 14-year-old. When I finally got it, a part of me was thrilled, but then there was a part of me that was sad because I'd let my coaches steal my joy. They abandoned me at the Olympic Games, and I realized I was a commodity to them. I think parents really need to be in touch with their children and make sure that their needs are met, uh, and pay extra attention to who's coaching your athletes and uh, their philosophies. I'm really looking forward to watching Team USA, especially in gymnastics. They're vying for the team gold medal, and I'm just so excited to see how it's all going to shake out.